all about what? Yeah, how everybody is handling some of the changes in our lives, given the circumstances affecting all of us from the way we shop to where we find entertainment and more. And this is a very special What's the Buzz because we have none other than our Vice President and General Manager General of Matt. WDIV, That's the right. big boss, <laughs> Marla Drutz joining us in right. studio. Oh, and also with Big Randy. Also Big right. Randy. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you have on Randy Moss's gloves? I have Randy Moss gloves, and I use this to go around driving in my car, going to the grocery store, whatever, not to touch things. So you keep wiping them off as you go. And that's what I'm using my gloves. All right. You know. So speaking of shopping, uh, in particular grocery shopping, do you guys have a strategy or suggestion for people to find the items that they need? There's a lot of hoarding going on, sanitizer, toilet paper. Well, you know, I have a, a philosophy and it's the go early philosophy. Mm. So I'll give you an example. This weekend, um, we needed a Costco run for sure. We had some pharmaceutical things we needed to get and what have you. So we got to Costco at about 10 after nine. They open at 9.30. And Costco should be running FEMA. Wow. It was so organized, and mm -hmm. they only they had spatial distancing with with lines and wow. different things. And because we got there early, and I'm gonna say to you guys, we made out. We got a 24 pack of toilet paper. <laughs> Holy shit! So smokes. I am telling. I'm gonna bring wow. some in. We're pretty stocked here, but just in case, I want to let you guys know I got a little extra. So my, uh, I think. It, don't go unless you have to, right. and my suggestion is go early. That's right, and if I run out, I'll stop by your office so you can help me out. <laughs> so this is a five, six, <laughs> seven, eight. But you know, you should try to go somewhere you're familiar with too, because a lot of stores that I go into, I know where the stuff is, so I try to get in there and get out in a hurry. Um, I saw somebody I knew, and, and we were like talking across the room, but I try to go where I know the product yeah. is, get in there, and since I am a senior now, kind of old, mm -hmm. get in there early, and that's a great one, but uh, they used to get in there late, but now you can't go late. I know, it's not an option. Yeah. You're right, no. you cannot go late. All right, so let's get into live sports on TV. No going to the movies. What is your go-to for entertainment at home? I, I tell you what, what my family's been doing, um, making videos. Oh. So we, we had a hustle video, and then we took a video we did right here. This is the five heartbeats. So we're out there, and that's my little grandbaby. We're just singing. So I got kind of out of control. You see, I'm going to put my foot up on the piano. Hold on, then. are you playing the, oh, you're not, you're I'm not playing, playing but, the you know, piano. But we, got, we got the video rolling, and so I got really involved in it. You put the Don't suit no on diamonds. and everything. Don't need no pearls. <laughs> I'm the king of the world. <laughs> I got nothing but love for you. <laughs> the only thing. I love how you got dressed up for it, though. That's funny. I'm just waiting for Robert Townsend to walk in. That's that's so I was kind of out of control, hilarious. but you know, you gonna go a lot. You get stir crazy sitting at home by yeah. yourself, man. So. Yeah, well, Marla, you're a sports fan. What are you doing? You must be having withdrawal. Well, I am, and um, I do. Fortunately, I'm able to. You know, like yesterday, NBC had on uh, a golf from uh, last year, and I really didn't remember who had won the tournament. <laughs> so I watched that. A tiger came in second. He was really good. So I spent some of the afternoon doing that. And then one of the things we, before all this started, we had bought a fire pit, and we'd never assembled right. it, just a yeah. small one for the deck. And so we've been standing around the fire pit a lot. And uh, you know what? It's kind of fun. Like the other day, we, um, we had marshmallows and stuff like that, um, Sweet. chicken sausage Sweet. one night. So it's just, it's kind of very mellow. Bring my, uh, our music system outside and blare it so all the neighbors can hear what we like. There was a lot of Luther Vandross going on I last love night. It. Nice. I love it. That's very cozy. And that's a perfect segue into the next and last thing we're going to talk about because we've all got more time at home. Great opportunity to maybe hone a new hobby, get back to an old hobby, trying something new. What are you doing, Randy? We know Marla's got the parties on her deck. <laughs> I've, been, awesome. I've been cleaning up areas. I, two drawers I pulled out that had all nothing but junk in them. I put it on my, my grandbaby's little table and I pulled it out and I cleaned those drawers out and I'm going through all my t-shirts. I got 50 zillion t-shirts, I only wear about 12. And I'm gonna get them to a home, uh, homeless shelter for men. So I'm going through all those t-shirts, but I find myself, and then you clean up all this stuff and it's only 11 o'clock. I know, right? Up, I get, Cause you know, I'm, a, I'm up early in the morning. So all right, what are you doing the rest you know, of the day? Whatever. And, and then I made breakfast the other day, next thing I know, it's only 11. Yeah. What do you do the next, 
I don't know. That's what you, you find the next hours. junk drawer or the next hobby or thing to clean up that you didn't finish. You know, when you have the big boss in studio live yeah. on camera, it's kind of you've got her captive. I have an idea. Oh, 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 no. I have an idea. oh, oh. <laughs> How about if we go back into the archives and and uh, pick a Tiger game that used to that would have been shown in 1984 with right. with uh, Al Kaline, mm -hmm. and George Kell. Right. We just show it as, as as if it was an air check from back there for like a time capsule. What a sensational idea. The Count only scary. Uh, Count scary. Oh, I Count love scary. Count Scary. Oh. The only problem is you do have some rights clearance issues. But right. I do want to assure everyone we are looking in the local four archives as we speak. And that is a plan that we have because we have a rich history of great programming here. So don't be surprised in the not too distant future if you look up and you see something that looks a little familiar, Ooh. but brings a big smile to your face, because okay. you're exactly right. I like and I would like to say one thing if I could, and that's that one of the things I've been thinking a lot about during this time is the gratitude that I have. And that gratitude is so much extended to the folks that are here today, to Jason, to Toddy, to Randy, to Tanya, to all the folks, Tammy and Jay, uh, to Lisa, all the folks that are making this show possible. And you know, um, in the morning, one of the things I would encourage folks to do is make sure that you make Live in the D part of your day, because we're really dedicated to being positive about our community. And frankly, there's no time more important than right now. And I just, again, want to give you guys the biggest shout out Thank uh, you, from Thank the bottom Marla. of our collective hearts here at the station for what you guys are doing. So take care and thanks for having me on. I'm a long time listener, first time caller. <laughs> <laughs> well said. Thank you. Thank you so much.